Hey guys, so if you watch me usually, you're probably gonna notice that I've had the other side of my lip pierced. I'm just throwing that out there straight away because I know that people are gonna comment about it. So um, it looks a little weird because it's got a black bar in it that's really long and stuff. So please just ignore the fat swollen lip right now. Um, today I've got a new box that we've never had before and it's called Coven. So um, this is a UK box and it's $32.99 a month with free shipping. I don't know if they do worldwide, I'm not going to lie. If they do, I will put it down in the description, but I think it might just be a UK only box for now. Um, the word coven kind of gives off like witchy themes, I would say, but this is actually a horror themed box, this specific one. Marchie's theme is witch's brew, so... It could be just a mix of like horror, witchy, gothic kind of thing, I would say. So um, yeah, I'm just going to open it and show you what is in here. I have already opened it just out of pure nosiness and it's pretty cute actually. So um, this is a little card on the top. It just says Coven, thank you for your order. Then we have a little sheet of what is in the box. So I'm not going to read like what is in it but the theme is horror fest this is the january box um it says all items are vegan and cruelty free and they donate one pound for every box sold to the sophie lancaster foundation so if you're not from the uk you might not have heard of the sophie lancaster foundation but if you want to go and look it up it's a super sad um like killing that happened so they have a foundation that's like against hate crimes and stuff so that's really nice um and then this is what the box looks like it's got some cute little like paper confetti bats and stuff the first thing right on top is this really cute little pennywise um this is a super cute plushies like funko like a funko pop kind of branded um teddy and he is really cute. He is 8.5 inches, so not too small. Definitely going to put him in the horror room. Love him. So that is our little Pennywise. Then next we've got a little Funko Pop mystery. Um, I can see through who it is, but I am going to open it to show you. So we've got a very cute little mini Jason. I've never had any of these mini Funko Pops and it's actually pretty detailed for such a tiny little thing. So that is very cute. Then next we've got a patch. So this one is a saw patch and it says, hello, I want to play a game. And it's got jigsaw on there. It's got like that kind of stickyish sort of back. So I'm assuming it is an iron on patch, but you can sew it on as well if you want to. So he is very cool. Might put him on like... A denim jacket or something then next we've got a bit of a set so i wish i would have seen these before i went to watch the new scream because they are so cute but we've got some little dangly earrings dangly earrings aren't my thing honestly but i kind of love these so they've got a little ghost face head and then they've got like a little mirrored blood knife as well on each one so so cute even if you didn't want to use these as earrings you could change them into like little key rings or a little necklace or something absolutely love those definitely keeping those even though like i say i'm not really into dangly earrings but they are too cute so there is those and to go with that we also have a little matching choker so this is on just like a little velvety strap and it's the same little ghost face as on the earrings so a little necklace and earring set then next we've got this little package and in here there's just like a little button pin it's from fangirl pins on etsy and it just says final girl i don't love button badges honestly i prefer like the push pins but it is pretty cute though so we have that then we have some little nail stickers 
So they have like bloody handprints and lips, crosses, just blood drips, stuff like that. Basically these stick onto your nails. I used to get a lot of these when I was younger. I'm not really sure how you do them. I can't remember, but I think you've got to like put it on and then wet it and it sticks on and you just paint some clear varnish over the top to keep it on. So that is those. We've got a bunch of horror stickers. So there is a Hellraiser one, a Child's Play one, um, a Nightmare on Elm Street one, a Jason one, that one's really cool, and a Pennywise one. I actually just got a big Pennywise tattoo yesterday, so if you don't follow me on Instagram already, um, I'll put my Instagram down below so you can see it if you want to. And then we've got three things left. So we've got this one, which is a really cute soap. It's um, strawberry scented and it's got all little horror characters in. I'm not sure if it's going to really show up great on camera, but it says the Psycho Bunch. And we've got Michael, Freddy, Ghostface, Jason, Pennywise and Jigsaw. And it's in this red and white, like blood splatter kind of soap bar which is really cute i can smell it a tiny little bit through the plastic but not a lot but it smells like a really fresh kind of strawberry scent then we've got some more stickers which are horror cuties and these are just like really cute little sort of baby versions of all different horror characters of those and then the last thing we have is a hand painted item now i love the rest of the box i think it's an amazing box this is probably my least favorite thing um it's really cute and stuff it's just not really my kind of style but it says sweet dreams and it's got a little freddy painted over there so it's like a little wooden plaque so yeah, that was everything in the Coven Horror Fest box. So I will grab it all together and show you all at once. So we got the Sweet Dreams Freddy Krueger little wooden plaque. The Horror Cuties planner stickers. The little Final Girl button badge. The Saw patch. The very cute little uh, Scream earrings. The matching Scream choker all of the little horror stickers, the little nail stickers, the strawberry psycho bunch soap, the tiny little mystery Jason Pop Funko, and the big Pennywise soft toy Funko. So all of these items in the coven box for January. Like I said, I actually really, really liked this one. I thought it was a really cute box. A lot of different items. I love like the little soft toy and stuff. I think that was really cute. Um, yeah, definitely one of like the better boxes that I've had in a while. So I thought this one was pretty good. You'll have to let me know what you thought of it down below. Um, I'll put all the information for them in the description in case you want to go and check them out. And I hope you liked the video. If you did, please subscribe and I will see you soon. Bye guys.